name is Kian Pan. Before you connect the battery for the first time, it is very important for us to remove the propeller. We have a five propeller here, four lifting propeller, one is a forward propeller. So the reason for us to remove the propeller is because when we do the testing for the first time, and obviously we are not going to fly, we just want to make sure the all the motor, the motor and the control surfaces like this aeron, uh, no, sorry, this is the elevator or this is the wing, the aeron moving in the correct direction or moving accordingly. And we also want to test whether the autopilot work in the correct uh, way. Okay, so it is very important for us to remove the propeller because we don't want the motor spin up suddenly or suddenly spin up for any reason and that can be very very dangerous because this propeller is very sharp and we get hurt very easily. So make sure we dismantle the propeller. Okay, to dismantle the propeller, the front propeller is very simple. Just a few bolts here, later on I'll show you. But this lifting propeller, we got four, and uh, for newcomer, it maybe it's quite easy to confuse which one is which. So I highly recommend you label the propeller before you dismantle. Like this one, I have labeled it, I have labeled. Okay, how you label, my way is uh, I label it as this is the front right hand rotor, front left hand motor, rear right hand propeller, sorry it is propeller, and front left hand, uh, sorry it is the right hand rear propeller. Okay, so I repeat, this is a front right, front left, rear right and rear left so the generally how we uh, distinguish whether it's left hand or right hand we are imagine we are sitting inside a plane we are the pilot we're sitting inside a plane facing forward basically pilot is definitely uh, facing forward so right hand side and left hand side so this is how we to the right hand or left hand. Okay, once you label it, okay, you label it, then you can uh, uh, start dismantle this propeller. The tools you need is just one piece. This is a, a two mm Allen winch. So I have here is a very high quality hoodie Allen Allen winch. If you can get it, you can also get from those uh, Allen Allen winch like this one, Tanaji from Hobby King, or this one, also similar. So you can get it online, or if really cannot get it, also maybe those are hardware shop, you can get those L-shape uh, Allen wrench, but those may not last very long, because yeah, it's not specially built for this purpose. Um, okay, so you take this uh, 2mm uh, Allen wrench, you can start remove the propeller. So for the front, uh, for the front, uh, this uh, propeller is uh, one bolt in the middle. Just put in. Take it out. So this spinner con is we take out already. And this bolt you get drop. So this bolt drop easily. So make sure you uh, put it in the very safe place. Okay. Then here we got four.
of the four pieces of nut and of the bowl. is removed so when you install back here I've got one on the seat here obviously you want to put it this way and uh, actually you cannot put the other way around it's very wrong and you cannot install it actually okay once you put it put it aside then you can uh, start uh, this mentor this propeller this propeller got two bolts here just this mentor it using the 2mm also Here we have a spacer. This spacer here, they have a, a sitting here. They have a whole seat here. So you don't want to put the other way around. Otherwise your bowl will be loosened. So this is top. Put it here. Okay. So you do the suspender the, the other bowl. Make sure you have labeled the propeller. 